Hey everybody. A few years ago I shot a video about using razor blades to scrape your aquarium glass and I discussed how the razor blade itself cannot actually scratch the glass. The, the material razor blades is made out of is not hard enough to do so. And when I'm talking about a razor blade, I'm talking about one of these. I'm talking about a standard razor blade, not any kind of special carbon cutting tool or high carbide steel or hardened steel. A standard razor blade that is made out of a type of metal that is typically called razor steel. In the industry, there's a very specific steel this is made out of. And on the hardness scale, this steel is not as hard as glass. It's not even close to as hard as glass. So it cannot scratch glass. It just simply cannot do it. And yet after having discussed this in the video and explained it all, I still, years later, get people responding to that video telling me how I'm wrong and I don't know what I'm talking about and how their razor blades somehow scratch their aquarium glass or whatever. So today I decided I was going to look it all up again and I was going to find all the numbers and so on and so forth. And I never got that far because I came across an article that I found really annoying, honestly. And it was a discussion about the, the argument between the glass cleaning industry, professional window washers and um, you know construction sites, when they do new construction, somebody has to go through and clean all those windows uh, before the new building is up for renovation or whatever. And so there's an argument between those people and then the manufacturers of windows. The glass cleaning people say you can use steel. Steel doesn't scratch glass. It's not hard enough to scratch glass. You can't physically do it, so steel is perfectly safe to use. The window making industry, however, says don't ever use steel on glass because steel can scratch your windows. And I got puzzled for a minute there because steel cannot scratch glass. I don't know what these window people are talking about. They're supposed to be industry professionals, and yet they're claiming that a steel razor blade can scratch glass. It can't do it. And so I keep reading because I'm fascinated by what their logic behind this is. And eventually they come right out and say they understand that steel can't really scratch the glass. But what happens is in these industrial or, or construction type environments where you've got these windows that might get construction material such as concrete dust and so on and so forth will get on the glass and then when you use the razor blade to clean it it leaves scratches behind so they understand that it's the concrete dust that's scratching the glass but somehow they're saying it's the razor blade that's doing it he then made the dumbest analogy I've ever heard in my life and said if you were ra shaving with a razor and you got cut, would you blame the pimple or would you say that the razor itself cut you? Does it make a difference? Of course it makes a difference. And yes, in that case, it is the razor that's cutting you. In the case with the glass, it is not the razor that's doing any damage at all. You can use a razor to scrape your aquarium glass until the cows come home and it will not scratch your glass. It cannot be done. If you go down at the bottom and drag some of your substrate up with the razor, the substrate will scratch your glass, but the razor will not do it. Making that argument is the same as making an argument that a piece of soft cotton cloth can scratch your glass. Because I ran it through sand, and then I ran the cloth up my aquarium glass, and it got all scratched up. So it must be the soft cotton cloth that is responsible for scratching the glass. I would even make the argument that soft cotton cloth or the filter material, that, that poly material that I use to, to wipe my glass, that's more likely to scratch my glass than a razor blade because when you get down near the bottom, what's more likely to pick up little bits of grit and material? That fluffy cotton stuff or a piece of, of thin metal razor blade? You know, I'm much more likely, and that's why if you ever look at my tanks, you'll see like right across the bottom where the substrate is, it's dirty. I don't ever clean all the way down to the substrate, because if you do with one of those pieces of cloth, you're going to pull substrate back up with it. Maybe even pieces so small you can't even see them, and then you're going to scratch your glass. But it's not the cloth that is scratching your glass. It's the substrate that gets caught in it. And likewise, it's not the razor blade that is scratching your glass. It's the substrate that gets caught in it. And the glass making industry that's claiming that razor blades will scratch your glass know that a razor blade cannot scratch your glass. It simply cannot be done. So stop telling me that a razor blade 
scratched your glass. A razor blade did not scratch your glass. Something else attached to the razor blade on your glass, something. But the razor blade did not scratch your glass. You may as well say a piece of cheese scratched your glass. It's softer than the glass. It can't scratch it. Simple as that. So, sure, I'm going to get a lot of comments under this one. I'm going to get a lot of people telling me how wrong I am, how dumb I am, and how razor blades scratch their glass. And I guess that's just the world we live in. So have at it. You know, tell me how wrong I am or whatever. But for the rational people out there and the reasonable people out there, trust me, a razor blade will not ever scratch the glass in your aquarium. It's the substrate that gets caught up in the razor blade, and that can happen with any type of scraping implement, whether it's soft plastic, an old credit card, uh, a soft cotton cloth, anything can bring your substrate up along the glass and scratch the glass. So if you're afraid of that happening, then don't ever wipe your glass down with anything, because anything is just as likely to scrape your glass as a razor blade will. Cannot be done. Don't worry about it. Razor blades are perfectly safe to use. Now, getting in the corners and slicing into the, you know, the silicon seals, that's a different story, you know, but that's not scratching your glass. That's a different issue with an aquarium and using razor blades, and you got to be careful with that. And, of course, always dispose of your razor blades properly and safely. So that's my two cents for today. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe. You never know what you're going to get with me. Hope you enjoyed watching that one, and I'll see you real soon in the next one.